I have yet to do the trail. Uh, that's okay. I, I was a trail angel last year. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, so what is your name? Gigi. Is your trail name? Greyhound. Greyhound. And you hiked uh, last 2000, year? Yeah, last year, 2023. Yeah. Yeah. And, like I say, about 45 minutes from now. Hi, I'm Munn from Pennsylvania, down here in Georgia, helping feed people blueberry yeah. pancakes, vegetarian chili, and grilled cheese sandwiches, Gatorade, coffee, hot cocoa. Keep yeah. it simple, keep it stupid. <laughs> and, and, and that's what we love about it. Right? This is my 51st year of doing trail magic of some form in the course of my life. I've been doing it since I was 10. You're amazing. Thank you so much for doing that, feeding and all I the hikers. It. All right. So I understand you don't have a trail name. I don't. No. no. I'm waiting. I'm, I'm, I, I thought I'd wait till about 100 miles. And, and the other problem is, I th not problem, but I realize you have to stay at shelters to get a trail name. And I've been doing you have a lot to of, do crazy yeah, things. I've been doing a lot of stealth camping. So, oh, okay. Uh, back country spots. So. so what is your name and where are you from? Uh, Chris. I'm from Crittenden, Kentucky. Nice. Yeah. Oh, hey, you haven't had having a good hike? Yeah, my hike's been awesome. Uh, You've had great told, weather, told, right? Told somebody else. Yeah, I started on Saturday, so this is day five for me. Good for you, um, man. And uh, yeah, I, I know I'll have bad days. I've not had one yet, so yeah. <laughs> it's too early yet. Yeah, so, I mean, you know, it's, it's five months. You know? Right. Okay. So you have a social media account? Yeah, so I'm blogging uh, on my blog. It's just chriskelly.org, K-E-L-L-E-Y. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, try to post there like every day. All right, well, we'll get on and uh, start following you, cheering you on. Thank you. Good luck on your hike, man. Appreciate it. Tell me again your, your trail name. Uh, my name is Cool Breeze. <laughs> so I'm here walking in my family tartan. My family are Glaswegian Hendersons, and this is our tartan. So nice. I've done two Caminos in it so far, and now we're going for the 18. Oh, Yay! We're hoping to do it this year. Yeah, we're hoping to go in a few weeks. Oh, the Camino is amazing. Yes, yes. yes. Yeah, it's really great. Great. So really you did great. the French and which other? So I've done, I've done the French France? and the Portuguese. Nice. So the French from St. jean pierre de port and then the Portuguese from Lisbon. And uh, both times I met an Episcopalian priest from Oregon. And so this summer we took uh, a load of ladies from his congregation, uh, and my mum came along and we did the last 140 kilometres of yeah. the French way again so they could get their Compostellas. Yes. Oh. So I've done it a few times. Uh, that's, that's exciting. Awesome. Yeah, just have a bit, a bit of time bonding. You know. yes. Do you have any social media? Anybody can follow you or anything like uh, that? So I'm blogging on the trek. So if you look for Cragen on the okay. trek, you'll find me. Uh, and I've also got a Facebook page that's open with my photos from the day. And that's uh, Cragen's Hiking Adventure. Awesome. Well, good luck on your hikes. Yes. You. Okay, I got Rich McHale here. Um, he was just telling us about uh, this picture that he has he's carrying. What's his name again? Mark Heimball. He was 11 years old in okay. 1991. And then tell me the story you just told us. I'm a retired police officer from Middle Township, of New Jersey, and Mark is a boy who lived in Delhaven, New Jersey, 11 years old, with his mom and uh, older brother. And uh, November 25th, 1991, he went to the playground, and his mom went to take a friend to pick up their car from the shop. And when she came home, he wasn't home. There was a frantic search for him. For about a week, we had firemen, helicopters, K-9. And uh, from that point on, it became a criminal investigation. And for 32 years, there's not been a trace of Mark other than 9 o'clock that first night, his L.A. gear sneaker was found on the beach um, about, uh, I would say, 100 yards from his house. Uh, in a direction going away from his house. And um, we've had suspects and people of interest in the case, but nobody at this time has been criminally charged in connection with Mark's disappearance. Um, just before I came out for the hike, I spoke to Mark's mother, Maureen Heimball, and asked her permission to hike in his honor, which she gladly said absolutely, and has, has supported the investigation and everything that we do to keep Mark's name in the public eye. And I want to thank you for letting me get this message out. Thanks. Again? All right, do you have a trail name? I do not. Uh, okay, so what's your name I'm and where are you from? Mary. Mary Corbett. From? Where are you from? I am from just outside Chattanooga. 
Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. In North Georgia, but so you're used not, to these mountains. Not too far away. No. no yeah. No, no. I practice on Lookout Mountain. Yeah. yeah. So she's she just explained to me that she's a newbie, and she's hiking alone. So everybody wish her luck, and uh, she's doing great. She's made it to Unicoi Gap. So yeah. From Neils. From Neils. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. She's doing great. Thank you. Hi, uh, my name's Otto. Uh, I'm from Nevada. Uh, I guess my trail name's Fresh Produce. <laughs> Did you accept Fresh Produce? <laughs> it only a trail name if you accept it. So. Sure, yeah. Okay, so this is Fresh Produce from Nevada. All right, how's your hike going so far? Uh, pretty good. Uh, I did have to hitchhike from Hawk Mountain to Neil Gap uh, to I uh, rearranged some gear, so I'm a little bit ahead of the starting oh. of the people I started with. Uh, nice. But I'm hoping to catch back up with them. Well, if you hit sit here long enough, maybe they'll catch. <laughs> We've got. I understand there's vegetarian chili and uh, pancakes, so who knows how long you'll be here? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Stay here indefinitely. That's right. Well, good luck on your hike, man. Thank you. Which trail name? Marathon John. Marathon John, where are you from? From uh, just outside of Toledo, Ohio. Nice. Yeah. So what made you want to hike the trail? I know you're going to ask. Uh, it's a lifelong dream, and uh, I'm just doing a section of it right now. But nice. maybe I'll, I might I might press on, depending on if I link up with some. Did you start at Springer? Yeah, back in October. Now, uh, it's a pretty time to hike. I've yeah. hiked well, I, I started at McCola in, in uh, October and got to, I got to uh, Whittlesey. Hog Pen Gap is where I left off. Right. And that's where I started at Monday. Nice. At Hog Pen Gap. Great. So. Well, okay. well, hopefully. Fourth inside, I've done 14 miles. Good so for far. you. It was cold. Cool. It was cold, cold. Well, good luck on your hike. Do you have a trail name? I do. It is Keg Stand. Keg Stand? Yeah. Can you ask how you got it? So it's a two parter. Okay. Um, one, I, I was a gymnast and I do a lot of handstands. Okay. Especially when there's a pretty view and a picture to be taken. Nice. Um, and then my Tramley for the fellowship. And we all bonded over beer. So it was first, you know, when I first did the handstand in front of them, they said, Oh, it might, you know, you're going to be handstand, and then um, Underhill over here, he upgraded to keg stand, because that just stand. fit us a little better. Nice. Okay. Well, enjoy your pancakes, enjoy your hike. Thank you. Thanks. Um, I'm Ann, and I'm from Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Oh, nice. So this is flat for you, too. Oh, you know, not so much. <laughs> not so much? It's just, just sea level. <laughs> okay. Okay. And uh, I'm Underhill from Under Virginia, Richmond. Okay. And how did you get Underhill? Uh, so that's a Lord of the Rings reference. Um, oh, okay. I'm carrying the the One Ring, and racing Frodo to Mount Doom. So uh, <laughs> One Ring to yeah. them all. I gotcha. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. guys, enjoy. Thank Good you. luck on your hikes. Thank yeah. You. Thank you so much. Uh, Anthony Murphy. They call me Ant, and I'm originally from Michigan, and now living in South Carolina. Nice. We're gonna let him go eat his his burger. There we go. All right. Thank you. Enjoy. My name is Guy. I haven't gotten a trail name. Guy? Guy, where are you from? I'm from New Orleans. New Orleans? Yep. Okay. Nice. I'm on day six. Nice. And my ankle hurts bad, so I'm going to the Hiawassee to see about it. Sorry. Yeah. Hopefully they can give you some good stuff and get you back on trail. I hope so. All right. Do you have any social media or any way we can follow you? Not really. All right. Well, good luck. Thank you so much for this generous uh, hospitality. Uh, all you're welcome. Us. It's the much. smile on your face is why we do it, you know. Thank you. No trail name yet. Okay. Names are up right from Ohio. Okay. How's your hike going? It's going good so far. Okay. All right. How many days you been on trail? I started the 12th. I had to take a couple of days off the trail. Okay. Uh, wife was yeah. with me. She went home and uh, uh, now we continued okay. on. All right. Well, good luck on your hike. Thank you. Um, my name is Rachel. I'm from New Hampshire. Um, I'm hiking a section just until the North Carolina-Georgia border. Okay. And I'm hiking because I did all of the 48, 4,000 footers. In yes, congratulations. Thank you. In the White Mountains and I really fell in love with hiking. So I figured. Oh, so this is flat for you. A little flatter, but the, <laughs> the distance and the up and down make up for it, so okay. it's still been very challenging. Okay. People so when, have been wonderful. So when did you start? I started March 16th. Okay. So, nice. Well, yeah. good luck. We wish you all the best. Best. Thank you so much for doing this. 
Hey, I'm uh, Touche, and this is Merlin. Touche and Merlin. Merlin and I have already encountered each other. <laughs> so, um, where are you from? I'm from North Carolina, what near part? Asheville. What part? So, near Asheville. So I'm sort of headed for home here. Oh, we're from the Greenville area, so exactly. we're neighbors. Well, we probably <laughs> hike in the same mountains. Probably. All right. Well, we hope you have a good hike. Thank you. You and Merlin, even though he's not happy with me. <laughs> <laughs> Hey y'all, I'm Donna at the Green Dragon Hostel. We're at mile 52 at Unicoi Gap. Um, come on see us. We offer free pickup from Unicoi and Dick's. We'll take you into town, we do your laundry, and you get a free and you get a hot cooked breakfast in the morning. So come see us, y'all. Come see him. I'm Marie Small and we're from Wisconsin. Wisconsin? I'm his mom is around here. So he's over, yeah, he's over there. And this is our dog, Meteor. We call him Meaty usually, or, or Meatball. Or meatball. <laughs> yeah. we're, we're from Wisconsin, and we're... Cool. Are you doing the whole trail? Yep, we're planning to do the whole trail. Good job. How are you doing, buddy? You enjoying it? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Do you have a trail name? Not yet. Not yet. How about you? Uh, no, we're still waiting, but... Uh, okay. He, he did get one last night, but he was in two feet now. Okay, yeah, it only counts if it, you yeah. accept it, so. <laughs> right. All right. So, well, good luck. So far. Okay. Well, good luck on your hike, guys. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I appreciate all of your oh, you're welcome. Real magic. It's the smiles That's that we do it for, yeah. <laughs>